Hey, this is Shiraz. And before we get started, I just want to let you know that when I clear something for someone, when I cause a shift, I tend to yawn and cough from the energetic shift that happens. I don't know why it happens. It's just how my body works. And if you don't know that, you're going to listen to this video and go, what the hell is wrong with this guy? You might still think that, but now there's more of an explanation. The other thing to keep in mind is that if you hear something that you can absolutely relate to, when I cleared for them, you can get it cleared for you too. Just say yes when they're saying yes, and it works. It's, I have people that watch these videos every morning to get stuff cleared. This can be your new morning habit too. Okay, that's enough for that. Let's get on with the video. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you get a great shift out of it. See you soon. Well, there, there's a few words that pop into my mind. There is hard, um, needs to be hard. Um, Okay, let's stop right there. Why does it need to be hard? Because <laughs> mm, that's been the story around. So, okay. my parents, um, they worked hard. They mm -hmm. both worked. Okay. So it needs to be hard. <laughs> If you don't make it hard, are you letting them down? No. Okay, that's not coming up true. So are you willing to step out of the story that if you don't make it hard or don't do something that is hard, you're letting your parents down? Mm. Ow. <laughs> you feel that? <laughs> yeah, just yeah, sort of just connected the dot there. Um, yeah, I'm willing to let that go. <coughs> okay. There's two different ways you can look at things. Um, Actually, there's a lot of ways you can look at things, but there's two things I want you to look at in the way you can create your life. And one is you can create obstacles or you can create challenges. Okay. Obstacles is what you've been doing. Mm -hmm. So I need to make it hard. I need to show my parents I'm, I'm making it. I need to show other people this is hard. So you actually make things harder than they need to be so you can work hard so there's that satisfaction. Look at me working hard. Mm -hmm. okay. And most people function from obstacles. They're just like, I need to get through this. And then this always comes, there's always something that shows up. And then they are in those stories and they hit obstacle after obstacle after obstacle. Mm -hmm. When you get out of obstacles, you can go into challenges. And challenges is when you start from the state that things are good. I got this, we're fine. But I need a challenge. I want to amp things up to take me to another level, to create growth. And this is where it's not like obstacles feels like all these things keep coming at me. There's all these barriers and blocks and I have to break through them or overcome them to get to where I want. But challenges are, okay, here's where I am. This is cool, but how can I make it better? There's a playfulness in challenges, right? There's this, what is possible challenge, whereas obstacles is like, how can I just get by? How can I, you know, I just want to stop all the pressure and the stuff like that. There's, it's a whole different energy. And when you start to live your life from, I'm going to create challenges and accomplish those challenges rather than, oh, I just have all these obstacles to get through, everything becomes easier and more fun and more light. So are you willing to step out of the story that your life is full of obstacles? Yeah. Ooh. Okay, how's that feel? Buzzy. Buzzy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I told you it wouldn't take 10 minutes. <laughs> Sorry? I told you it wouldn't take 10 minutes. Yeah. Okay, is anything else coming up or you just want to feel that buzz? <laughs> I'm just going to feel that buzz. 
Okay, cool. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a like. And if you had a shift of your own, I'd love to hear about it in the comments. Also, check out the description for energetic magic events that you can attend every single month. Be well, be aware, and be magical.